our uh, director, Brandon Smith, along with uh, Joseph Mandeville, are storm chaser extraordinaire. And they were on the road today, tracking down the severe thunderstorm cells that were rolling through portions of Bay County, Walton County, and Jackson County.
$1 difference from earlier today. Uh, it's chilling down. Have yeah. you stepped outside in the last few minutes? Uh, last few minutes, yeah. It has yeah. dropped from like mid-70s to the mid-50s. Well, you said we were going to have a yeah. little change in the temperature. <laughs> you weren't kidding, huh? Uh, you know, and it's interesting. I had a little bit of a, a question whether or not we'd get the severe weather that we got today because of many of the computer models just did not have it in the uh, solution for today. But as warm as it's been and as humid, you really, when you get, get a cold front coming in like we have, you really have to expect some things to start popping, and they did. Yeah. Now we get set for cold. <laughs> Winter is still on. We go, of course, here till the middle of March, but you know, usually it's over by the end of February. Hey, let me show you our uh, Panama City City Cam. Uh, looking southward, the cloudy skies, the cloud deck much higher now. Humidity is really cut, and uh, you will not see those low clouds and hazy conditions like we had all of the last 48 hours. We have scoured out the low level humidity. Now, let me show you some pictures. Now, our uh, director, Brandon Smith, along with uh, Joseph Mandeville, are storm chaser extraordinaire, and they were on the road today tracking down the severe thunderstorm cells that were rolling through portions of Bay County, Walton County, and Jackson County. Look up. This is straight up into the cloud. You see how turbulent and roiling the clouds are. Lots of lift. And uh, when you, you see cloud decks like that with a little bit of a lowering cloud base, indications that there's some fair instability there. While no uh, severe tornadic signature showed up, it was pretty close. Uh, and indeed, this storm cell, as it moved into South Georgia, had indications that there were tornadoes being reported. But you see the, the rolling clouds and the cloud formations. This is at the back edge of the storm, looking back on it to the north and east while it was over Jackson County. So tremendous pictures there of our storm-chasing dynamic duo. Now, it's time to call 896 <laughs>